Um, I got into coaching while I was in university. Uh, I picked up a serious knee injury my sophomore year. And in the off season, when we uh, more or less play friendly matches, I wasn't able to participate. So the coach asked me to be involved with the team, um, become part of the coaching staff. And uh, from those first moments, it looked like I had a gift to be able to pass on football knowledge. So I have uh, two that I would say is definitely high up on the list. One is the 2006-2007 season here domestically. Um, we won the first division, Shield, and then the FA Cup um, in one season. And we are the, was the first and is still the only team to have won the FA Cup, being in a lower division. So I, that achievement in itself sticks very dearly to me. And I would say more recent times was being part of the Bermuda national team coaching staff that led Bermuda to, the, to its first ever Girl Cup. So this will be the two most significant moments uh, so far in my coaching career. Um, I, I look at how I have evolved as a coach. Um, I look at the various generations of players that I've actually uh, been, in, been in contact with and coached. And to stay relevant is basically is continues to study the game, attend courses, seminars, um, and in modern day time, you know, constantly on the internet to see what the latest trends are. So I, that would be the biggest advice I give. I am pleased to receive this award. Um, it's a proud moment that our club is going 65 this up and coming season. It's a testament to our forefathers and everyone from the past to current um, to get us where we are today. Um, I'm honored that the current executive um, w w would honor me in this way. So I want to say thank you to the executive and the Coates family for um, offering me this award.